What up to my peoples and welcome to Retro Crunch and to start off this week's retro pop culture news. The 1980s is known for its pop culture icons and Max Headroom is right up there with the top of them. So I was really excited when I read on Deadline.com that Max Headroom is getting his own reboot. Now before you guys flip out, it's also been announced that Matt Frewer is going to be reprising his role as that iconic Max Headroom character. This show is going to be developed by AMC Network so it wouldn't be too far-fetched to believe that it's probably going to first premiere on the AMC channel. Other than Matt returning to play Max, there really isn't a mainstay actor that I feel would really need to be cast um, for the fans to get on board with this reboot. Matt Frayer, who played uh, Max and also the TV reporter Edison Carter, can have a whole new cast, and I think that this show could still be great. So far, we don't have a release date for the show or a list of the actors that are going to be in it besides Matt, um, but I am interested to see if they're going to be sticking with the same plot and storyline, or are they going to take this in a whole new direction. With the popularity of social media and the internet, there are a ton of things that they could do with this Max Headroom show that can make it really good. I'm real anxious to learn more about this announcement, so once I find out more, I'll be sure to let y'all know. But until then, if you want to catch up on some of the old Max Headroom episodes, you can actually watch the whole series on the streaming service Tubi right now for free. And then next up, back in 2020, uh, we talked about a announcement that the Tiny Toon Adventures was going to be returning with a brand new show. Then after two years of waiting, there's finally some concept art uh, that was released at the San Diego Comic Con that's going to show what the characters are actually going to look like in this new Tiny Toons Luniversity show. It looks like most of the original Toons are going to be back for the new show, which is really cool to see. Not that I was really worried about that, but I'm glad to see that there's more news that's coming out about it. And speaking of cartoons, did you know that George Jetson from the 1960s cartoon The Jetsons was born on July 31st, 2022? So that means in another 40 years or so, we should be living in space and driving flying saucers to work. And before we go, I have to plug this new movie coming out of India that I think you might like, especially if you like foreign films. There's a retelling of the classic Forrest Gump movie that's being made in India. I just watched the first trailer for it and I loved it. Now, you'll have to read the subtitles if you want to understand what's going on, but what I saw from this trailer seems like it's going to be a great version of what Forrest Gump would be like if it took place in India. I think it's going to be coming out on uh, August 11th, um, so you might have to hunt it down because it's a foreign film, but I know that I'm for sure going to be looking forward to uh, watching this. I just got to find out where to stream it. And that's your retro news for the week. If you're into retro news and nostalgia stuff from back in the day, I'll see you in the next video. I'll catch you on the flip side, and remember, if it ain't retro, it ain't worth watching.